from the cow to the ice cream. It doesn't leave our property until you take it home. Every step of the process is handled by a family member, even when it comes to handing you your ice cream cone. So we're, we're all very involved in the entire process. So it's truly supporting your community and we put a lot of care into everything we do. It totally reflects us. Hi, my name is Kate Dallum and we're at uh, Brooms Bloom Dairy in Bel Air, Maryland. We're actually a very old farm. Our family's owned it since 1726. We've only really been a dairy farm here for almost 25 years though. We have a small herd of cows, but we've recently started processing our own milk and making it into ice cream, cheese, and bottled milk that we sell here at our store. We've had our store now for uh, 16 years. We started off milking cows and then we built the store, but it kind of operated separately from the farm. And then when our children came along and they were very involved and very interested in it, we realized we kind of had this opportunity to combine the businesses together more and make it more sustainable. The cows are milked in the morning and we can be making ice cream out of that milk the next day or even before. It travels literally 700 feet, so there are a lot of environmental advantages to it as well. We recently started making all of our cheese here on site. We've been making cheese with our milk for about 20 years, but working with an Amish family up in Kirkwood, Pennsylvania. But we've recently put in our own little cheese processing center and we make cheddar cheese once a week and we make about 200 pounds at a time and age it in our refrigerator. We've just recently branched out to mozzarella and we hope to do feta and I'd like to do a gouda. So we're kind of slowly exploring other cheeses. It's been actually a lot of fun. I like making cheese. It's peaceful in the cheese room and it takes a lot of focus. It's a very precise thing. It's been very cool. The day that we got our permits and I realized we were ready to roll over there. It took us about four years to get to that point. It was amazing to me that we had opened up this whole world of being able to use our own milk and produce these products and sell it to the public. It took us so long to get there, but we had finally done it. Like we were finally closing that loop. It was really almost overwhelming when I think about my history with the dairy industry.